First of all, I want to thank you all for following me this past year. Without you, I would have retired this channel a long time ago. Seriously, if you asked me a year ago that I would have a YouTube channel with a thousand subscribers, I would think you're crazy. But now, I believe we can go even bigger. Now how big? Well, let's find out. However, with growth comes the growing pains. It seems as some peroxide, my video has become a lightning rod for controversy. And by that, I mean it has more than two negative comments. In fact, only acetone peroxide has been both revered and revired by the community. Everything else has received nothing but love. I can't stress enough the dangers of acetone peroxide, especially dry. Looking back, I probably should have put a PSA within the intro about its dangers, but I did put it in the description. However, if it gets more negative comments, I might have to unlist it and upload a more sanitized version with the PSA included. Speaking of which, I don't mind some name calling like crazy. I mean, seriously, I have like the Einstein here. Or being called uh, stupid or an idiot without uh, criticisms like, you're stupid for filling the beater up too high, or you're an idiot for not wearing safety glasses. But calling me a terrorist is just a bridge too far. I have reported those comments and I have deleted them from my channel. My lines I do not cross on Muggler Playground is that I will not, nor will I ever, make Schedule 1 or 2 class drugs, show you how to make um, an improvised explosive, or make chemicals that are meant purely to harm people, like neuromuscular toxins. If you've ever visited my channel, you'll know that I'm not some psycho pyromania. I've made experiments that are easily said so that the average enjoyer, the enthusiast, the casual, the hobbyist can all understand the experiments that I do. With the acetone peroxide that I make versus some that are posted, the clear difference is that it is wet. Weapons grade acetone peroxide is dry. I repeat, dry acetone peroxide is weapons grade. My wet acetone peroxide flames out like the gunpowder video that I posted. With that said, I cannot wait for what 2025 has in store for me. I wish you all an amazing year and I hope you keep good on those New Year's resolutions.